Hello Madridistas and thanks for joining us on today's interesting episode as we talk you through some very important updates at Real Madrid. Kickstarting with today's agenda, Real Madrid have been dealt a major blow as Kiel Mifeda Eduardo Camavinga could be sidelined for 8 weeks. We are going to talk you through that on this episode and shortly after that we will quickly turn our attention elsewhere as Manchester City striker Erling Haaland Ergen has commented on the player's future stating the solution will always be found. We are also going to be talking you through that on this episode. So please stay tuned right up to the end. Do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel. You can always choose to follow us on Twitter for more Real Madrid updates by clicking on our Twitter link which is available on this video's description. In a major blow for Real Madrid, IS is reporting that midfield man Eduardo Camavinga could be out for 8 weeks due to a knee injury. Camavinga, just 21 years of age, suffered a knee injury while on national duty with France on Wednesday night when he clashed with former Barcelona winger Ousmane Dembele during the training session. Even though initial reports suggest that there was nothing serious about the midfielder's condition, more tests raised concerns and it was soon decided that he would leave the national team camp and return to Real Madrid. There were concerns raised about Camavinga's condition due to the pain he felt and the restriction in movement his knee, in his knee last night. Tests revealed that he had sustained a sprain in his knee as confirmed by France Football Federation who has called up Kefrem Turam to replace the 21-year-old in the squad. Eduardo Camavinga, who had to cut short Wednesday training session, underwent an examination in the afternoon accompanied by Dr. Frank Le Gall, the French national team doctor. The Real Madrid midfielder has sustained a right knee injury. Today, he has, re he has been released to his club, the FFF Confederation confirmed. Now as RS is reporting that Camavinga would be out for a period of 8 weeks, which would be a major blow for Real Madrid. It would essentially mean that the 21-year-old will be ruled out of the remainder of the 2023 season and will return only in the new year. Camavinga is expected to undergo more tests and scan either his this afternoon or tomorrow at Real Madrid, following which a clear picture of his condition should emerge. But initial signs indicate that the 21-year-old star could be out for more than a month, possibly up to 8 weeks. With Aurelien Chouameni already out with an injury, Camavinga's situation as a major concern for Real Madrid. It could, however, open the doors for Tony Cruz and Luka Modric to get more minutes in the upcoming matches. Having concluded with that, we are going to quickly turn our attention elsewhere as Real Madrid targets Erling Haaland's agent on his future claims solutions will always be found. Erling Haaland's representative, Rafael Pimenta, has said that if there is any clause inserted in the forwards contract related to Real Madrid, it is only known to Manchester City, the player, his father and her, and nobody else. It is, not, it is to be noted that Pimenta was spotted at the Santiago Bernabeu a few days back, but as reported before, the purpose of her visit was not at all related to the possible transfer of Erling Haaland to Real Madrid. As such, while Real Madrid are indeed said to be leaning towards Haaland over Mbappe, a new development regarding the latter future might now swing the pendulum the other way. Speaking in an interview with George Picon, Pimenta shed light on her client's future saying that she, he is a major of his destiny. He is a master of his destiny. Erling Haaland is a master of his destiny. 
not just now but his entire life and 100% she said what I mean is that you have to use balance we club and player we are all in the same boat things have to be talked about and treated in such a way that everyone is okay I think it is not necessary to say that Arlen does what he wants that is not true Arlen is always going to do what is good for him and the club Manchester City when everyone is willing to make a change it will be done he is not the type of player who is going to say I am leaving bye I don't want to know anything it is not like this and it is not going to happen because respect comes before everything if they give it to him he will give it to she explained it is no secret that Haaland is loving life in Manchester City and for Real Madrid to break the forward partnership with Pep Guardiola it is going to take more than money to convince him to move while speaking about it the agent said respect comes from both sides I have no doubt that they will respect it too if one day something has to happen everything will be agreed upon because there is respect for understanding the other's position eventually when the question regarding the infamous Real Madrid specific clause was asked she said there is no club mentioned in his contract but even if there is it is only known to a handful of people nor Erling's contract is known to Manchester City his father himself me and nobody else she said Guardiola is infamous for having a feud with top strikers such as Latan and even Samuel Eto'o when asked about her client's relationship with the manager she said you have to ask Erling this but as far as I know from the feedback I have they get along very well Answering the question of whether or not the forward is happy in Manchester City, she said, You have to ask him too, and this does not mean the opposite. I know he is, but I don't like to speak for others. I see it like this. The sporting result comes when things are good. When there is positivity, harmony, energy, things come. She concluded. So having talked on that we have come to the end of today's episode thanks for following us right up to the end please do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel see you next time and hala madrid to us all